My patient thought she had allergies for five years until we tested her for Sjogren's. This was a young woman in her 40s and she was getting chronic urticaria, chronic hives that were refractory to regular treatments with things like Benadryl and other antihistamines like Claritin and Zyrtec. She also tried Pepsid, which is a histamine H2 blocker. And you couple that with an H1 blocker like a Benadryl, and usually that could take care of the hives. But in this case, it was not. Eventually, she was found with a positive anti-nuclear antibody or ANA and sent to our office, where we did a further evaluation and noted that she had chronic fatigue and some significant sicka complaints. We eventually tested her for Sjogren's, and this came back positive. What we did was treat her with hydroxychloroquine. So hydroxychloroquine was shown in a allergy and immunology literature study to help with chronic urticaria or chronic hives. And we know that it helps with hives that are from autoimmune conditions. So she is now on hydroxychloroquine. She still sometimes needs a Benadryl at night for some breakthrough, but overall she is doing much, much better than she was. Just know that sometimes uh, you may think it's allergies, but it can be an autoimmune condition. And one that is a little bit sneaky is Sjogren's. So make sure you're tested for Sjogren's or see a rheumatologist. If you have questions, please leave a comment below.